everyone. Thank you for tuning in to Embrace My Melon. And it's your girl, Rochelle. And in today's video, yes, as you saw by the title, I am going to be doing my September Boxy Charm Box. And this is a luxe box for September, okay? The third one so far this year. Um, I can't wait to see what I got inside of my box. So if you want to see what we got this month and what's good and what's bad and what's, what's what it is, <laughs> please keep on watching. And if you have not already subscribed to my channel and this is your first time seeing me, well, baby, what, what you waiting on? Go ahead and click that subscribe button. And if you like these types of video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, please, and thank you. All right, so let's go ahead and just open up the box. I've already tore the thingy right there, and let's go ahead and open it. And there it is, I can't see nothing because that big old piece of paper right there, okay? Alrighty, so this uh, month's, uh, let's see, this month's theme is a glam vibes only. Okay, and it looks like uh, the crosswalk with the going back to school and everything. And how are you guys surviving um, with that? Um, my uh, best friend, one of my best friends, she's a teacher and oh, it, it's, 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 it's just hectic. Not only her for on the teacher side, but she see how it's wearing on the student side and on the parent side. So if you guys are parents or anything like that, or even if you're teachers and you're, you're seeing me right now, how are you guys dealing with the whole virtual teaching thing? And how's it going in your state? Of course, here it is. I live in Savannah, Georgia. So uh, they have not decided to send the kids back uh, to school. Some of the teachers are uh, working from home, but some of them are also working from um, working from the schools. So how's that going for you guys? Let me know down in the comments section because oh, it's just it's just hectic for her uh, right now trying to make sure that the students stay engaged and, and all of that. So anyway, leave that down below in the comments. So back to the box, okay? The first thing I see, and this is something, the first thing I see here is um, from Fenty Beauty right here, okay? We have the Fenty Kilowatt Foil Duo um, Highlighter, and I got it in the shade Seven Day Weekend and Poolside. Now, mind you, I don't have any, no, I don't have any of the Fenty um highlighters okay i could tell you i wasn't really interested in any of them because a lot of them that i saw they were very glittery instead of just shimmery so i decided no just not to get any okay but here it is right here okay let me go ahead and just swatch these the colors that i probably wouldn't have not even wouldn't have. I know I would not have chosen this probably, but okay. The colors are really, really pretty. Really, really pretty. There you go. All right, this pretty purple and a pink, okay? Okay, well, the Fenty, let's see here. Let me take a stab in the dark. I think it's, re yep. Retails for $36, okay, not bad. I got a Fenty added to my collection, all right. Okay, so next up in the box, it says, guess what? You'll be naked in one minute. Okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's an original coffee scrub, okay. It's foliate, um, it's for smooth glowing skin, okay. And I guess it's by a company called Frank Body. Good. There you go, right there. Okay. Now I will say that I did try the last coffee exfoliator um, that I got. I can't remember if I got it from Boxy Charm or if I got it from Ipsy, but I did get that, and I thought it was okay. But the packaging, this is much bigger, bigger than that packaging. I thought it was okay, so I'll probably be able to give you more of an in-depth um, thought process on whether or not I like coffee, say over sugar you know because so far I've been doing my sugar scrubs and I love my sugar scrubs okay okay so that is from Frank body and okay that retails for $16.95 okay not bad not a bad price point at all not 
chocolate. Okay, so next up we have, ooh, we have from Kate Somerville, okay? We have the Exfoliate Intensive Exfoliating Treatment. Right there, I'm not sure if you guys can see that, I'm sorry. Let's see if I can put it right Nope, still can't see it, okay. But by Kate Somerville, okay? And um, this is the first thing I've ever gotten um, from Kate Somerville. Um, I've been meaning to try uh, this brand. I've heard amazing things about it, but I just never, I just never went out of my way to get anything. I will say that, okay? All right, but this is, okay. All right, I think I know one of the reasons why I just didn't go ahead and invest in it. This right here retails for $85. $85 for this. Okay. I, listen, my skin been acting up lately. And, um, well, I, I, I can't wait to see what this do because, you know what? I, it, it, I can't even get it open to smell it. Okay. But I'm going to, I will be trying this out and I will let you guys know my thoughts next up i have the cara therapy cara therapy it is a deep conditioning mask okay is it deep conditioning for the yes okay so it says revives um revives and repairs dry or damaged hair jojoba walnut and chestnut oils penetrate deeply into the hair for unparalleled moisture, strength, elasticity, 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 and brilliant shine. Okay, it says apply once a week after shampooing roots to ends. Okay, alrighty then. Now, is this what smells? Is this what smells so heavy? Yes, this is. Okay, so the perfume smell that I've been smelling since I've opened this box came from this. Okay. So if you're not that much of a, a, a very fragrant, heavy perfume scent, you might not like this. I don't know if I'm gonna like this because of the way it smells. But you know what, I'll try it anyway. I will try it anyway. It's a deep conditioning mask and I'll have to look up some reviews and see what it do, okay? Cara Therapy from Carabon, I guess, Carabon, let me see. Let's see here. Uh, yeah, Care Therapy Deep Conditioning Mask retails for $24. Okay. Alrighty then. And this is a big size. This is a big size bottle too. It's eight fluid ounces. So we'll see what this do. We'll see what it do. Okay. All right. Next up here, I have, it looks like it's some brushes inside of here because if you saw my last haul, um, I've got some... Um, Morphe brushes, um, and they were inside a container very similar to this, but that container is black, and this one is very, very curly pink <laughs> from um, Pure Cosmetics. Okay, let's see here. Where are you? What are you? Where are you? Okay, Pure the Complexion um, Authority. Uh, this is a 12-piece travel size brush set, okay? Okay, 12-piece with a little cup holder thingy and you get the, ooh, the pretty pink brushes. Okay, alrighty, and this retails for, I was just saying what, oh, this retails for $49. Okay, alrighty then. Alrighty then, retails for $49. Mm, well, I guess not, Bad, but I've never used any pure brushes, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It, it seems a little steep for 12 brushes, but then again, I don't know the quality of their brushes, so we will see. We will most definitely see about that, okay? Alrighty, next up we have Hip Dot. Hip Dot, I've never heard of this company. Okay, let me see if I can get... Okay, all right. And, ooh, oh, this is a very pretty palette. 
Look at that. Ooh, that's pretty. Alrighty now, okay, the company is called Hip Dot. All right, so it says the Zion eyeshadow palette, okay, and it retails for $30. Not bad. Not bad at all. It's very, very pretty and very warm. That purple right there, that purple is calling to me. It's a very pretty. Ooh. Ooh, that went on smooth. Oh, that went on so smooth. Let me try a matte. Let me try this deep berry. Oh, oh boy. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. So I've never heard of this company, but I'm going to have to try out this palette because, wow, those were nice that matte was so freaking pigmented man okay thirty dollars thirty dollars not bad not bad at all i love the colors and i love the packaging the marvel packaging on this i've just never heard of that company before hip dot okay alrighty then um i got a lip gloss here from persona persona uh cosmetics okay and the shade is called Honey. Okay, let's see here. Persona Cosmetics Season 1 Lip Gloss retails for $16. And there is the shade right there. Honey. I can see why they call it honey. Okay, and let's go ahead and do it right there. Ooh, this is pigmented. That is really, really pigmented. Ooh. Ooh. That's pretty. That is pretty. I would probably very easily, like, um, match it with, uh, of course, like, you know, Max uh, Chestnut or either um, ColourPop's BFF4. Here is the last one. We have the 111 Skin, gotten products from them before. 111 Skin Rose Gold Brightening Facial Treatment Mask, okay? Um, it's inside this big packaging right here. And it looks like I get five, okay? I get five facial masks inside of here. Yep. Five facial masks, okay? Alrighty, and let's see here. Okay, the 111 Skin Rose Gold Brightening Facial Treatment Mask, five pack. Hold on, I gotta do some quick math. 135 dollars. $135 was 10 would be $13. That's $27 for a mask. What? One mask is $27. Okay. All, all right. All right. Um, the ultimate pre-event mask this hydro gel formula infuses the skin with radiance boosting ingredients for a glowing complexion Ooh, okay I'm gonna have to try this I am going I am going to have to try that because listen if you got $27 for one L listen um yeah i'm gonna have to i am most definitely gonna have to try that wow okay okay so after some quick calculations okay it comes up to, to a total of 391 dollars and 95 cent okay that is a lot that is a lot in this one box. It's almost $400 worth of stuff I got here. 
wow. Now, of course, the mask is what really tipped it over. But, oh my goodness, that's like a lot, okay? And, of course, the Kate Somerville alone, with it being $85, you know. Okay, all righty then. So, so far with this box, honestly, honestly, I could say... I'm still loving my Lux boxes, okay? Um, they're still giving me quality things and they're also still giving me products and I should say brands that I've never heard of, okay? Of course, I have never heard of Frank Body and I have never heard of Hip Dot, okay? And I'm really interested to try this particular brand and their eyeshadows because when I swatch just those two colors, I'm, I'm telling you like, that matte color alone was super, super pigmented. Like, it left a stain. I wiped it off, and it still left a stain on the back of my hand. So, I do like that. I do love that I, that I got the Kate Somerville um, exfoliator for um, my face. I've been wanting to try Kate Somerville, and now I do get to try her, okay? I am... As always with some hair products, I am a little leery about the hair product right here. I'm going to see um, what it does. I just don't like that. It's so freaking like fragrant. It's just like so, it's just so fragrant. And I hate overly fragrant like stuff. Like I just, I, I just don't like them. Okay. But that's just me. That's just me, okay? But overall, I am still happy with getting uh, my box from um, BoxyCharm. Um, I still need to contact BoxyCharm to see if I can get the Premier box and get, um, and also get the Lux box every three months. So I still need to find out about that. I still don't know about that, okay? But overall, that is it. That is all for this video. I thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this kind of video, please remember to go ahead and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to stay blessed, stay beautiful, and continue to stay safe. Bye. <laughs>